So ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Liverpool Master League. This will be probably the final episode. And uh, we've already clinched the title, but we still have an FA Cup final to go in a, in a Premier League game against Man City. So um, we're going to concentrate on the FA Cup final. Hopefully everyone is up for it, and they are beautiful. Brozovic still out. Yep, yeah, he didn't get to make the final, which is unfortunate. And uh, I'm really happy with this lineup. I'm going to keep it like that. Coutinho, oh, it's tough, man. They're not really doing it for me. That center mid place, Brozovic was doing it so well. And now it's it's very hard to fill his shoes. Um, but I think Coutinho is up for it today, so I might as well let him play. Unless we swap him with Firmino. I think that could be the better switch. And we'll keep it at that. Mane, Origi, Sturridge and Aubameyang, Moreno, Saka, Matip, Klein, Karius. Let's go and beat Everton. We've done it before. Let's go and win the FA Cup this time. So it is a beautiful day at the Metropole Arena. Liverpool versus Everton. A Merseyside derby once again. We only played them last episode as well, I think. And uh, we beat them 1-0. It was a tough game. Um, so it's going to be about taking your chances early on and trying to grind out a result. Here's Lennon. Aaron Lennon's back, which is not good for us. As a broom is holding on to it a bit too long. We couldn't get it off him. I hate broom, I mean. Look at this. It's broken for Aubameyang. Aubameyang's going to run. Aubameyang to finish it. Good goal. What a goal from Aubameyang. Perfect start. And he'll volley it in the goal again. It opened up for us, man. They lost it. I don't know what happened. But look at the pace on Aubameyang, man. And a perfect finish. Keeper wasn't expecting a front post in the air. Hit the top of the net. Beautiful. 1-0 up. So Everton have been rattled. Um, let's get a second goal. Let's kill off this game. Moreno, get back in position, buddy. Oh, referee, what happened there? Sacco, oh, that's a good cross to Barkley. And it's one all just like that, man. It had to happen. Typical. But, um, yeah, I mean, one all. We've still got a lot to play for. Everton are lucky, man. What can I say? They just got lucky. So we've had some issues trying to stop that little cross that comes in. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. This cross here where... They do a little through ball like that, and it's a volley. So we we lost to Chelsea like that, and hopefully we don't lose today because of that. Balassi, we played up to Mane. Now we can get a cross in. Decent ball. Oh, referee. Oh, man, what's, what's the keeper doing? I don't know why I called the referee. Play back. Firmino. Inside to Origi. Origi to pull the trigger. Great save by the keeper, and there has to be a foul at the end of that. Where, where's my fouls, ref? So Baines will pick up a yellow card. The problem is we just haven't got a good free kick taker. No one can do a free kick well. Um, what I'm going to do is probably aim. I don't know. Just aim there. See if we can try our luck. Here's Coutinho to hit it. What a save. We're trying to get a rebound there. We couldn't even get the rebound going our way. As Lukaku picks it up. He loses out. We play it through. And another crunching challenge. Referee, where's the free kick? Thank you. So we get another chance with a Bamiyang. Now, I don't know how this is going to go, but I'm just going to let it fly. Here's a Bamiyang. Oh, goes top corner, but the keeper read that well. Here's Moreno, bringing it down the left. He plays a forward, and Lennon reads that all day, boys. You've got to do better than that if you want to pass around. Barkley loses out. We play it up to a Bamiyang. A Bamiyang in to Sturridge. Sturridge, referee, what's with the challenges, man? Can you send some of these players off? It's getting ridiculous now. So another free kick today, and uh, I don't know who to, who to get to take them. They're just, no, none of them are going in. Um, let's try and chip it over here. Continue, it's going to hit the wall. Goes over the wall, and Lili, I don't know what his name is, Lili, with the save. Lukaku looking for a 1-2. Barkley decides to have a crack, and why can't Karius catch that? I don't understand. Moreno, got to cover Lennon. Barkley plays it back to Lennon. Ball over the top to Balassi, and it's 2-1. They're always going to win that header. Oh, ridiculous how Everton are still getting goals, man. We, we've outplayed them the whole game. It's going to be just one of those. This is going to be one of those games. So it's a bit ridiculous. Everton are powerhouses with their physicality, man. And Balassi was always going to win the header off Klein. I just don't understand how they're still in the game. We've been absolutely dominating them. Play it there. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. you got to be joking. How slow are you to turn? Ridiculous. Ridiculous how they're getting chances after chances because of our midfield. So something's got to change in the midfield. Coutinho is coming off. He's been absolutely crap. 
Oh, I need a ball player. I'm going to bring... No, Lalana's too slow. One Adam's coming in. That's the problem. But they'll still score here because a cross is so overpowered in this game. Look at that. They almost scored. Like, ridiculous. So that is half time. A disappointing half. I don't know how Everton are leading. They don't deserve it. But Bruma and Ashley Williams have been fantastic so far for Everton at the back. Come on, Firmino. It's got to take a good ball. I bet you it's going straight to the keeper. It's not. We can't get even a header on target. Impossible. Moreno cuts it out. We've got options down the left. Too slow to turn again. Aubameyang, you're looking crap, mate. But we do run down the left. Oh, they're always there. Get away from my players. Ref. Oh, backbreaker, mate. He's Klein. Klein against Baines. We got him all day of the week. What a crap pass. What a crap pass. He's going to get there as well. Get it out. Oh, my goodness. As Coutinho brings it up. I mean, Firmino brings it up. Here's Origi. Now we've got options. Aubameyang's making a run. Good run. Bruma's coming across. Have a shot. Oh, we can't score. Unlucky. So I'm going to make one change. Ayanacho's going to come in for Origi. And I'm going to move uh, Aubameyang down the left. I'm going to bring Ayanacho up front. Is Ayanacho. Oh, my goodness. This team absolutely ripped me today. His Quadrado, whatever his name is, Guadrado. Far out, man. Get away from me. Here's Lennon. We win it. Oh, straight. It's like they always got a backup player for every player, every position. Go for me now. Run forward. Gets blocked. Seriously. Aubameyang, he heads it to Balassi. Oh, my goodness. So frustrating. This team, so frustrating. Three minutes to go. Look at that turn. Play it forward. Let's get a goal. Come on. We're Liverpool. We just won the league. Here's Sturridge. Play to the left. Oh, it's fallen. Get there, Ayanacho. You are fresh. Ridiculous. And that's the end, boys. That's the end. Play it forward before the clock rings. Play it. I see someone there. Finish it. Oh, how did he miss? Oh, my goodness. How do you miss? Oh, we've lost the FA Cup to a bunch of bums. I can't believe it. I'm sorry if the I screamed and your headphones are gone, but Jesus, I'm frustrated. We played terrible, and Everton did not deserve it. Ridiculous. They defended with their heart out, boys. I'm sorry. I couldn't deliver. Their, their defense was crazy good today. Bruma and Williams just did my head in. They, they stopped everything I could offer. And in the end, we had that big chance. How did you not hit the target? I don't understand. Who shot that, man? Because... I swear to God, at this stage, I'll even sell them. So we lost the final. 2-1 to Everton. Disgusting game, really. It makes me sick that I even lost. I want to win everything, and I couldn't deliver. But boys, hopefully winning the Premier League was enough this season. I couldn't deliver the Europa League, and I couldn't deliver the FA Cup, even though we deserved it. Um, Everton did play really well on the day, man. They, they did really, really well. Um, their defense was crazy. Bruma and Williams were just crazy good. Um, yeah, I, I just couldn't do anything, man. It was impossible. And I raged a bit because it was so frustrating to play. But we still got a Man City game in the Premier League just to have a bit of fun and to close the season out. Um, I, I wish, I wish we won it, man. It's going to burn me now that we lost. But we still have one more game to play against Man City. So let's finish it off with a smile. And, uh... Yeah, the board aren't happy. We, we ended up runners-up, which is unacceptable. I mean, come on. I just gave you the Premier League, and you're still pissed off with me. The Europa League was en has ended, and your beloved Liverpool were quarter-finalists. That's unacceptable. I understand, but we played Chelsea. Um, Daniel Sturridge managed to make it to the top scorer of the Europa League, and three players have made it into team of the tournament for the Europa League. Aubameyang has suffered an injury during a match. He should be back in July. Well, thank you for the great news. Um... I miss Brozovic in that game, man. If we had Brozovic, probably a different story. But Coutinho, I just hate to look at him. He's been crap, man. He's been absolutely crap. Brozovic still out for a week. You're going on the bench, Coutinho. I've had enough of you, man. You couldn't. You just can't deliver. I know you're playing out of position, but I put you in attacking mid and you're still crap. I think um, Lalana deserves to come in again. He's been good. And uh, I'm gonna play him. I'm gonna play Firmino up. Mane he's disappeared the last few games. Um, but yeah, we're just going to have a good run out against Man City. Don't expect me to beat them like 10-0. If we lose, we lose. I'm just having a bit of fun with it now. 
We've won the Premier League, boys. Let's enjoy it. Let's have a bit of a kick around. Let's try and whip their asses. But yeah, the main thing is we lift that trophy at the end of the game. So welcome to Etihad Stadium, and I like the blue and white touches around the stadium with the crowd. As you can see, Vidal is at Man City. Man City are a tough team. Remember how we beat them 1-0 last time? That was a bit of a grind. Um, so I'm not expecting much today. We'll probably get played around the park. But let's just have a bit of fun. We are the champions, and the main thing is we're going to lift that trophy no matter what happens today. So let's see. Man City probably need the points more than us. So they're going to come out firing. Here's uh, Nolito already with a shot. Jesus, calm down, Man City. We played to Klein. Klein all the way up. Who's making a run? Oh, Inacho's making a run against his former club to put it in. Oh, what a shot. We get a header and it goes over the bar. Here's De Bruyne. They play it up to Yaya Toure, who seems to have pace like a Bamiyang. Plays it to Aguero. Aguero with a shot. I think Aguero is going to bag a hat trick today. Wouldn't surprise me. Sacco win the header off Aguero. Sort of. Well done, Mane. Here's Sturridge to Ayanacho. He's through. He's not offside. Can he deliver? He's going to deliver. That's it. Oh my goodness. Where are you aiming, my friend? Where are you aiming? What a tackle. Break his legs. Here's Aguero. He's going to dribble past and score. No. Luckily, he didn't. Aguero is such a good player in this game. Plays it forward to Aguero. Aguero is going to make a run over the top. Another foul. Gundogan. De Bruyne. What a ball. No one's there to mark. And it's going to fall to Yaya Toure. Typical crap from PES 17. And Man City pick up their first goal. We should be one. We should have been. We should have had a goal under our name. We would had some great chances with Ayanacho. He just couldn't finish him. But the typical crap, you know. You can just feel when you're going to concede in pairs. It's just ridiculous how you can feel when you're going to concede. And look at that. Carrius, as usual, rebounds it to one of their players, and it's a goal, man. I can't wait to finish playing Pez 17. I don't think there's going to be a season two with this type of gameplay. We offload it to Mane with a bit of space. We play it up to Sturridge. I mean, they can't really contain our players. We're just not taking our chances. Ref, 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 ref. Oh, thank you. Jesus. And the problem with free kicks in this game is that you never score them as well. As Firmino kicks it over the bar again for the 10,000th time this season. What a tackle. Play it through. Finish it. Sturridge. Oh, come on, man. For a guy who scored 20-something goals this season, you should have got it on target at least. And that is the end of the half. 1-0 to Man City. To be fair, we had so many chances to pull one in. I don't know what's going on, man. Um, but there's nothing to play for, really, so... Let's just have a bit of fun in the second half. Here's Aguero. Over the top to De Bruyne, who hasn't really done much this game. He plays in a ball across to Vidal, who's going to line one up. A good save by Carrius. And we clear it. Oh, it comes off their players. Thank you. Still can't get it off any of their players. Ridiculous. And now Nolito is one-on-one. -on -one. They've got numbers back. What a goal from Nolito. Perfect finish for them. And it's 2-0 two two now, boys. The difference is they took their chances and we didn't. They played it across. Um, they found Aguero. And Aguero, Nolito was free. Klein was out of position as usual. And he had a free shot at goal, to be honest. Played over the top. What a ball. Here's Mane. Into the middle. Toure got him covered as usual. Like everyone is a bloody Maldini in this game. So the last chance to get our goal back, if we can. Firmino puts in a cross for the last corner of the season. And that is it, boys. Regardless, a pretty crap episode overall. Um, I, I knew we were going to lose to Man City. I just didn't have the concentration. We, did we didn't even really need to play that good. And how come we don't lift the trophy? In FIFA, you lift the trophy on the last day of the season. How come there's no big trophy and all that stuff in Pez? I don't know. Anyway, we won the league. I mean, a great achievement. It's hard enough to win the league, man. So if you can win the league in PES 17 on Legendary, that's a that's a pretty good achievement, especially with Liverpool, you know. I'm not saying Liverpool's crap, but we didn't have a an over, overpowered team like a Man City or a United or even a Chelsea. So we did fantastically well to win the league. We made the final of the FA Cup. Europa League was a bit, bit of a struggle. Um, maybe the second leg we could have done better against Chelsea. But boys, it was a fantastic season overall. The gameplay for PES... Started very good, but then when they started patching it after data packs, it just went to crap, boys. And I'm so glad to stop playing Pez for a few months 
I don't think there's going to be a season two, boys. I'm just not feeling the gameplay anymore. Now, I might do FIFA. Um, to just to do, just to be fair, I'll do a, a season of Pez and a season of FIFA each year. I think that would be nice. But let's take a look at the final fixtures anyway. Arsenal beat Middlesbrough. United beat Southampton. Stoke beat Bournemouth. And Burnley drew with Sunderland. Chelsea drew with Swansea. Spurs beat Crystal Palace. Watford beat Everton. West Brom beat Hull. And West Ham beat Leicester. So when I said that I wanted to finish... Um, the season up before we played Man City that was because I knew we were going to lose because everything that was going to go wrong did go wrong in this episode so we finish on 82 points 26 wins I knew 25 was the magic number but we did end up getting 26 we had eight losses four draws 81 goals for 37 against with a goal difference of 44 so we won the league boys a, a great achievement United finishing second on goal difference and they beat Chelsea and Arsenal finishing fourth their usual position all the time and Man City uh, finished in fifth with uh, Tottenham be, uh, finishing in sixth, sorry. And in the relegation zone, Burnley, Sunderland and Swansea. So I'm surprised Swansea went down. Um, but I guess who else would have went down in instead? So overall, it's been a pretty crap month. Um, we beat Everton to win the Premier League. We beat Leicester as well. Then we lost the FA Cup final to Everton 2-1. And we got pumped by Man City 2-0. But Aubameyang finished as the top goal scorer of the month. Uh, Sturridge with the assist. And Aubameyang finished with a 6.7 average rating. So the only Liverpool player in this team of the month is Aubameyang up top. So the good news is that Liverpool has uh, given me a contract extension. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do a season 2. Real Madrid has also given me an offer. That could be interesting. Um, we won the Premier League. We were named Premier League's best manager. Sturridge has managed to make it to the player of the season of the Premier League. So Sturridge was the best player as he got the top assists, and he got like 20-something goals as well. And three players made it into the team of the season, so hopefully we can take a look at that, I guess. So here is the team of the tournament. We have Sturridge, Moreno, and Klein. Um, I'm presuming Moreno and Klein because they got a lot of assists this season. I'm not sure, but I do, do, I do think Aubameyang deserved to be in there. Brozovic as well was fantastic, but a lot of Chelsea players got in. So it looks like there is a testimonial match. And uh, Casillas is retiring. If you want me to do one more episode with this testimonial match, let me know. I don't know if I'm going to... I mean, it's going to be an easy win, I guess. But if you guys want to see one last episode in the Liverpool Master League, let me know down below if you want to watch the testimonial match. Um, uh, look at Tony's up front. Dirk Kaut. There's Totti. Um, there's Clichy as well. Cesar is retiring. Casillas... He's on the bench. He's retiring as well. Antonio Valencia is retiring. So there's a lot of old boys at the moment. Um, oh, actually, I don't think that's Antonio Valencia from Manchester United. I think that's another guy. Uh, yeah, if you want to see it, let me know. I can do one more episode. Um, but yeah, it's going to be a pretty comfortable match, I think. We always us You always usually win against the old boys. But for now, whether or not this is the end, I've had a fantastic run, boys. I'm just going to save this game. I've had a fantastic run. It's been a fantastic season. A few disappointing losses like the FA Cup and the Europa League. But I would have loved to do a season two. I just don't feel the gameplay, boys, at the moment. The gameplay is, is just bad, man. I, I just can't stand the slide tackles and all that stuff. I need to take a break from Pez. And I hope you guys can understand that. Now, I do feel like playing FIFA. But the thing is, we're not going to start anything new until the end of January and I'll tell you why I'm going on holidays for a month I won't have time to record content for this channel I've done all my content for my main channel so I've had to do like two or three videos a day for that to keep up to with all the days that I'll miss and I just won't have time to record another season on this channel so we've got a month and a bit for me to take a break from Pez and to see what I'm gonna do when I come back in, in at the end of January something around there so boys um, it's been a ride, boys. We might do one more episode. If you want to see the old boys, let me know. But whether or not we do it, thank you guys for your support. It's been fantastic. We grew this channel. I think I started from zero subscribers. And through this series, we got 500 subscribers, something like that. Um, so I can't thank you guys enough for your support. I hope you enjoyed this series. And if I don't see you guys again, you can watch me on my main channel. You can follow me on Instagram. I do a lot of player faces, photos. Now I'm starting to get into the Instagram game as well. And uh, if you want to buy Pez for Christmas, you can do that using my Amazon link if you're in the US or some crap like that. But yeah, boys, thank you for your support throughout this series. We won the Premier League, something Liverpool has never done before. 
So, it's me signing off, maybe for the last time on this channel until January. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you want to see the old boys, let me know. I can bring one more episode back. But until then, peace out.